Hello my amazing sexy mofos, this is your boy Venomy here, I really do hope you're all okay and having an amazing day so far. In today's video I am back with another Fallout 76 video, and in today's video I've got a little guide for the beginners. I'm going to be doing a talking about script and how script works, how legendary modules work, how to re-roll your gun, just the basics. Now before we start, if you are new around here and like what you see, then please do subscribe to join this amazing sexy family. But now let's jump straight into this. Okay, first of all I'm going to be showing you where Rusty Pick is. This is where you're going to be spending most of your time in endgame, let's say. This is where you're going to be buying your modules, and this is where you're going to be... You can do your script at any train station. Most of you have probably seen a script machine by now, but that's the machine behind me. It's at every train station. Now, I'm going to start by showing you all my script. I've only got 54 on me, which isn't a lot, but it is enough to buy a legendary module, which is the main reason for script. Now, if you're wondering what the word script is, it's your guns, your one-star guns, your two-star guns, your three-star guns. Now, at the Rusty Pick, you've got a trader called Purveyor. You can buy legendary modules, one-star weapons, two-star weapons, three, power armor. This is all other weapons as well, different weapons, random. It could be anti-air, it could be quad, it could be mutant slayer. It's completely random. But most of the time, what you'd want to buy is these, legendary modules. These are what you're going to be using to roll your armor, your power armor, your melee weapons, your guns. Because that's the main reason for this video. How to re-roll your, your items, your guns, your power armor. Here is a script machine. I'm just going to be showing all of you what most of you are going to be doing and how it works. All your unwanted guns every day, you want to put into the script machine. Three star weapons, we're giving you 40. You got power armor, three star, that gives you 45. Three star armor gives you 24. That, that's being normal armor. But most of the time, you'll cap out your daily 500 very, very easily. Every time you do an event, Chances are you're going to be getting some script, either being a 1 star, 2 star, 3 star weapon. If you want to keep it, that's fine. But if you don't want to keep it, then you can give it to the script machine. And it will eat it, and it will obviously give you some script back. Using that script that it gives you from those unwanted armor, power armor, melee weapons, those guns, you can use that script to either treat yourself to a new weapon, or you could buy legendary modules. And that comes to the next part of the video. Actually rolling a weapon. How do we actually roll weapons? So if you come to any weapon workbench, that could be at Rusty Pick, it could be at White Springs, somebody's camp, you'll see all of your weapons that you have. For example, that's a bad enclave. I would want to re-roll that. So once you click on your gun and go on the, the actual legendary effect, you can roll it. I'll do a roll now just so all of you can actually see a roll in action and everything like that. We'll do a fixer, why not? So let, let me just craft a fixer here and then we'll do something like a railway rifle, for example. Something that's quite desired right now. So I've just crafted a fixer. You click on your fixer, whatever gun you want to roll or your badly rolled weapon for example click on random legendary mod obviously one star being one star, two star being two star and three being three I truthfully don't recommend one star, two star items at all I only ever go for three stars so you click on the three star option and you're gonna be given a pop up just accept it and the gun or the armor is going to roll you're going to be given a different effect on that weapon and if you like it you can keep it if you don't like it you can script it or you could re-roll it it's entirely up to you for example here this medics railway rifle not too keen on it i want to roll it 
So I'm going to roll it now, just using some of the legendary modules I've got. Stalker's Railway Rifle. Once again, I don't really like it. I am going to re-roll that. So I'm going to re-roll it again. Vampires. 50 chance of hitting vats, 15 bonus vats, critical charge, absolutely lovely. Now you can see I even made a, a game clip there just to make a YouTube short on it. But that is absolutely lovely. So if you roll the gun that you like, for example, just like I did there, then you keep it. And that is how Legendary Script works. That is how modules work, and that's how to re-roll or roll your guns. But I'm going to wrap this video up here. I really do hope you're all okay and having an amazing day so far. If you've liked anything you've seen, then please do drop a like on the video. It really does help me out a lot. And if you are new around here, please do subscribe to join this amazing sexy family. But I love every single one of you, and I'll see you all in the next video.